We're here with JJ Reich of Savage Arms to introduce a really new exciting product, the 110 Stealth. That's correct. It's the uh, 10 110 VA Stealth. Okay. All right. So the Model 10s are the short action, so that's going to be your 308 and your 65 uh, Creedmoor. And then the 110 is the long action, and that's going to be a 300 Wind Mag and also 338 Lapua. Yes. All right, now stealth means it's a chassis gun, but it's not our big VA uh, chassis that we've had in the past. It's a, it's a smaller, more compact, lighter weight chassis. Okay. All right. The firearm comes with everything standard on Savage as far as accuracy goes. Zero tolerance head spacing, uh, the Accu trigger, uh, button rifling. This one is a fluted barrel. It's also suppressor ready. Okay. Um, and the adjustable stock for the uh, cheek weld and also the, the length of pull. So it looks like this is compatible with AR furniture if you, if you wish? That's correct, yep. Okay. And then we also have a Picatinny rail for the scope, but also a, pick, uh, a further Picatinny rail for accessories and, and, and whatnot. But okay. yeah, this is, um, it's actually only about three days old. So the fact that you guys are seeing it and covering it is, uh, is pretty special because it's a pretty, pretty new gun for us. So some of the features and benefits of the 10-110 BA Stealth include factory blueprinted Savage Action, a monolithic one-piece chassis machined from a solid build of of aluminum, the M-Lock forend and Picatinny rail for easy configuration, adjustable accu trigger of course, a 5.8 threaded muzzle with brake. Um, on the Model 10, it's a suppressor ready, it doesn't come with the muzzle brake, but it does have the cap. A Drake one-piece long scope rail, a Fab Defense GR, uh, GLR 16, 16 position buttstock, with adjustable cheek riser and yes and the, well like i said the the thread protector is on the model 10 but the model 110 has the the brake i see here we have a p mag does that come with it uh, i believe it comes with the with a uh, with a magazine standard okay. with all savage rifles um, and, uh, you know, the, the best thing about this is the price point. Okay. Um, and I, I can cover the price points. Yeah, let's, let's do that. Okay, great. Um, let's see here. And here's, your, here's the sheet here. So the um, 300 Wood Mag is uh, MSRP at uh, 1484 and the 338 Lapua is uh, MSRP 1622 So an entry level on the 338 uh, Lapua at that price point is pretty special. Yeah. And then when you flip it over here, we have the 308 at uh, 1207 and 1207 as well for the uh, 65 Creedmoor. Now I noticed what we have here also. Uh, we're looking at the 308 version, 20 inch barrel. Now if we move up to 65 Creedmoor, it's 24 inch. Correct. Correct. Okay. The other interesting feature that I see here is it comes from the factory blueprinted. So it's. It, Yes, yep, that's a little bit of an extra um, step for us, but we, we thought it was necessary for, you know, the, the uh, durability of the fire. Yeah, so one thing that they won't have to, to do to kind of eke out the last bit of precision out of the rifle. Exactly, exactly. So. Well, great, and then tell us about availability. Is this something that they'd be able to find on the shelf now? Or you know, everything that we're releasing or announcing at the show uh, is typically more of a spring or summer release. So I don't exactly know when the release will be, but it'll definitely be, you know, in 2016. So. Okay. Well, JJ, really appreciate you taking the time uh, to show off well, your new product, and, and good luck. Excellent. Thank you. Thanks.